Happy Saturday, everybody. I hope you're having a good morning so far. I'm currently just getting ready. I actually don't have to be at the airport until 1. It's 10.53 right now, so I'm just getting my lunch ready. It's a beautiful sunny day today, but I know it's really cold, so I'll make sure to bundle up before I leave. But I'm currently just making my uh, lunch for the next few days, and I'll show you what I'm cooking up. So for my main meal, I made this Greek feta salad with quinoa, red peppers, black olives, and tomatoes. And then I roasted some garlic potatoes, and then I just have some little snacks as well to fill it in. I really want to start making my own lunches beforehand because it does get really pricey when you purchase food at the airport. Everything is like jacked up in price. I'm going to try and make some more food, and it's just a lot healthier for me, and this way I make sure that I'm eating the proper things instead of just fast food or processed food throughout my trips. So I'm going to try and see if I can squeeze in a quick yoga session beforehand, get ready, and then I will Uber to work today. So I will see you guys at the airport. Sunday the 16th, so we're not in Quebec City like our original uh, scheduled pairing was supposed to be. We were delayed leaving Toronto to go to Regina yesterday, and our Quebec flight was quite later in the evening, so it just did not pan out quite well. So they ended up reassigning us, but because we got back at like 11 last night, they put us in a hotel by Pearson, and today we are going to instead deadhead as passengers to Quebec City fly back and work that flight from Quebec to Toronto and then Houston and then spend the night. But we're expecting a snowstorm. You wouldn't really know that's beautiful and sunny here today, but weather changes like in a blink of an eye. I slept in this morning. I don't have to be at the airport until 11.05 actually, but I'm going to go a bit early. It's currently 9.24. Just having my coffee, did some yoga, slept in until 8, which was really nice and I woke up with the sunrise. That's our day right now. I didn't have a chance to eat my yummy lunch that I made yesterday, so hopefully I can eat my feta Greek quinoa salad today because I spent so much time working on it. I'll keep you guys updated. At this moment, because of weather and the pandemic, I don't have high hopes to go to any of the places that I've been scheduled for just based on the reality of the situation. Right now, we're supposed to go to Quebec and Houston, but I will let you know in a few hours uh, where we end up. Come along with me and enjoy your coffee. everyone I hope you're having a lovely Monday so yesterday as I mentioned we were gonna see how things panned out so we did make it to Texas it's nice and sunny here it's a whopping 13 degrees Celsius so it's not like incredibly warm but I woke up to see that Ontario got hit with a really bad snowstorm so our flights today were canceled cruise get asked us if we would prefer to stay in Houston for an extra day and then fly out tomorrow. So our schedule has completely changed. We're staying here all day 
and then tomorrow we are working the flight from Houston to Montreal and then we are dead heading back from Montreal to our home base and then we're done for the day and it's really nice uh, it's gonna be loud for a second we do have airplanes passing over because we were right by the airport But I just find it completely hilarious how everyone this morning was waking up with snow up to their feet. And I'm very grateful that I got to at least overnight somewhere sunny. But here, I'll show you a little bit of what it looks like. just got ready and I took a shower. I did my workout this morning. I showed you guys the really cool pool outside. It's still incredibly sunny. One of my crew members actually just called me. They want to go check out downtown. So I just got ready and then we're going to meet in the lobby at once. I have about an hour to just go kind of walk around. But it's Martin Luther King Jr. Day here in Texas. So we are going to go downtown and there's apparently some parades and some festivities happening. So it'd be nice to kind of join in on the fun and to just explore. So I will take you guys along with me as we sightsee Houston, Texas. snow day. Uh, we really lucked out with being in Houston overnight. The crew and I decided to venture downtown and go explore a little bit. I was most excited to get these opportunities to just get to know the crew because you're swapping crew so often when you're working. Uh, most of the time you're always swapping pilots. You're typically set up with your flight attendant throughout your pairing but typically the pilots are always swapping so it was really nice to get to know them a little bit. All just really cool people. I had such a great crew to work with this week. It was a day well spent. It was really sunny. I feel incredibly bad for my friends and family who live in Ontario because they got hit with a terrible snowstorm. Everyone stayed safe but it was pretty crazy so I am very fortunate and very glad to have been in Houston away from the crazy amount of snow but we are going back tomorrow so we will see what the outcome is once we get there. As of right now we're supposed to fly from Houston to Montreal, work that flight and then deadhead back to Toronto. Yeah it was a wonderful day. I had a lot of fun now but wanted to sign off but I hope you enjoyed this video. It was kind of all over the place as I had mentioned you never know where you're going until you arrive at the airport or even when to get on the aircraft. So it was kind of bouncing around a little bit, definitely not where we anticipated we'd be uh, from our original schedule. It's fine, we made the most of it, and I embrace every opportunity as they come, so it's all part of the adventure of being a flight attendant. But have a good night, everybody, and I will see you in my next video. Have a good one. Bye.